Yo guys, what's up? Today I'll show you how to enable the Intel Quick Sync. Like, there's a lot of videos on YouTube, but um, they don't know actually how to enable it. <coughs> a lot of people don't know, but some people might be they know. So, Intel Quick Sync video uses the dedicated media processing capabilities of Intel graphic technology to decode and encode it fast, ena enabling the processor to complete other tasks and improving system responsiveness. So, while using this encoder, you won't lag in game, you can record smooth. And then go into the settings and as you can see here i have only two options here and those options are like there's no intel quick sync now i'll show you how to enable it just right click on this pc go into the properties once you go there just click here on the device manager now as you know everybody should know that there's two kind of video drivers one is your for external graphic card and the second one for your internal graphic card now i'm using i5 third generation cpu and uh, i'm just reinstalling the internal graphic card drivers even i'm using the external graphic card for my out output but um, for quick sync and quick sync is a uh, encoder that work with your internal uh, graphic card that build in so as you can see now i have installed but in case if you don't have the intel inter, intel graphic drivers then simply you can right click on your custom uh, drivers and then you can search it on uh, windows update in windows update sorry now i just close it i have already um, installed now simply let's check out the bandicam just open the bandicam and then go into the settings once again and now you can see i have intel quick sync and it's work more better pretty better like i'm uh, recording the valorant with this encoder and i'm um, i don't feel like i have rgb ram and all the specifications is mentioned in description you can check it out see you in the next video till then allah hafiz bye bye